Hey Oracles, it's Anne, and today I have a reveal from Sparkle Penny Pincher, aka Angela. Actually, it should be the other way around. I have a purchase from Angela McGrill, aka Sparkle Penny Pincher. That would be the correct way to do things, but we don't do that here on this channel, do we? No. Anyway, um, yes, I'm back in front of the camera. Woohoo, look at me. I'm so fabulous. Anyway, um, the reason being is I'm waiting, um, I need to get a micro SD card for my phone so I can record more and I have more memory and all this other stuff. But anyway, I am almost out of memory on my phone, so I have to default to using my webcam for right now, which, yay, we're all excited about. Anyway, this is the beautiful card Angela has sent me. And it says, hey there, my crazy glitter addict companion. Hello. I uh, wanted to say thank you for your order. So glad you enjoyed my glitter so much that you could, you needed another fix. <laughs> uh, instead of sending half ounces you wanted, some of them are an ounce. The extra is part of my thank you gift to you. La, 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 la. I can't talk. <sighs> that is so sweet of you, Angela. <laughs> Um, hope you enjoy girly lots of hugs and glitter sprinkles. <laughs> LOL, your friend Angela McGrill, aka Sparkle Penny Pincher. I did it right that time. Woo! Uh, <laughs> uh, I am. Uh, it's one of those days, guys. So, uh, what she has sent me, um, in this little awesome card is. Two of her mixes, which are absolutely beautiful. Um, we have Mystic Unicorn Poop, and it glows. And she actually just made a video on this, so I'll try to post a link down below. So please go over, check it out, and watch it so you guys can actually see it in its full glory instead of this grainy, ugly crap that happens with my webcam. Um, and then on top of that, she also sent a new Dawn Rises, and it is also a glow mix. Super beautiful, super gorgeous. They are both full of color. They are absolutely amazing. Love, 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 love them. Thank you so, so much. So, let's get into the nitty gritty here, shall we? Um, my order, my awesome order, my spectacular fun ship of sparkle order, okay? Um, anyway, the first thing I ordered was some more lemon slush. If you guys don't know what lemon slush is or what it looks like, I will post a link to her. Um, one of her videos down below where she shows her newest additions to what she sells but um, basically it is this very beautiful um, it is a hexy style it is clear tinted yellow um, the reason I stress that is because when you get it in its individual self or you just get a light sprinkling of it you do not get the full effect of the yellow um, it it works best grouped together <laughs> um, because it creates more of a lemonade color if you guys can kind of see the lemon through the light um, that is absolutely gorgeous. I love, 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 love this color. Um, it is a very beautiful scattered iridescent. Um, it pops green and kind of gold. It's super gorgeous. I love it, love it, love it to pieces. Um, like I said, though, it is clear on its, like, if you just sprinkle it in to add a touch of yellow, you're going to have to add more because it is, it is a clear that is tinted yellow. Um, but together it looks absolutely gorgeous. Love, love it. Honestly, guys, seriously, go check her out and buy it because it's so, so gorgeous. Um, next, if I get my glasses adjusted and get myself adjusted, is Black Cosmos. Um, this particular glitter is a mix. And it's not really like a mix in the sense that we mix where it's like full on, like you can see like eight different colors in it. It is, um... I would say a scattered mix where basically it is 90% black with about 10% dark, like holographic blue, iridescent blue in it. I, you know, I'm trying to, I would say it's more of an iridescent blue in it, but it's kind of spec, it's kind of sprinkled throughout the black. Um, so it kind of like looks like the night sky and the stars. Um, I don't know if you guys are going to see the actual color difference again. I will try to post a link to her video uh, reveal of all this so you guys can actually see what the true colors look like. With my webcam, it is just crap. So, anyway, let's move along, move along, moving right along. I don't know why the Muppets came into my head, but it did. Um, anyway, this is a glitter must-have alert. If I had the thing, the flash, warning, warning, alert. 
this is a glitter must have and the reason I say that this is um, a clear diamond clear hexi um, what it is is it's just a hexi that is clear that adds sparkle the reason I say it is a must have is because you ladies out there who have difficulty making enough mix for a swap or whatever this is your best friend this adds sparkle does not affect the color or add a color change at all to your mix it just extends your mix by adding a little bit more to it um, so basically what I mean is if I have a mix and I end up making a mix but I only had enough mix to enough glitters to make enough for like four people because you put a teaspoon in each so say I only have enough for four teaspoons instead of the five or six that I may need I add in a little bit of this so maybe a half a teaspoon of that and there I have extended my mix enough to go from four people to six people um, so it is a must-have and again it's clear so all it really does is add an extra pop to it but it does not affect the color that you use so this is an absolute must-have um, if you're a newbie out there so um, again I will post a link to Angela so you guys can go check her out um, then there is mint slush this is a beautiful absolutely gorgeous iridescent um, this reminds me of fish scales is basically what it looks like um, just because it has a golden sheen it is absolutely gorgeous but it looks metallic see like my camera uh. <laughs> anyway again it's another must-have um, absolutely gorgeous I'm trying to see if I can like ooh, ooh. you can't see anything now who knows what I think on a daily basis Jesus who knows how I function every day? How's that one? Anyway. <laughs> um, you missed me. I know you did. We both know you missed me. You missed looking at this and listening to this. Anyway. Um, the next thing I got is a mint hollow. This particular hollow, um, it, it is mint, um, but it's almost closer to a sage um, then it is a mint, but it's gorgeous nonetheless, and it is a micro hexi. The reason I call it a micro hexi and not a fine glitter is because to me, fine glitter is sandy glitter. Like, you can't tell if it's a hexi, you can't tell if it's a shard, I mean, you just, you can't tell. It just, just looks like sand. Um, so this is more of a micro hexi, um, in this gorgeous hollow, linear hollow mint green. Again, camera, not gonna do not gonna do for it <laughs> so um, this is absolutely gorgeous I love this color um, you have to see it in person again link 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 down below so you can see it and see it in its full glory um, the last but not least the last thing I did purchase from her were these yes contact lens holders see yes um, no uh, these are three gram pods of cosmic effect dust um, my brain just completely stopped um cosmic dust effect glitter um this stuff is amaze balls okay i'm gonna say it amaze balls absolutely amaze balls um this particular glitter um angela suggests that you don't actually like put it in mixes or anything i have just because it has a little extra did you guys see that Okay, moving right along. <laughs> I'm not scared right now at all. I did not just get chills all over my body. All right. Anyway, Cosmic Dust Effect Glitter. Um, this is amazing, 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 amazing. That's all I can say about it is um, it's amazing. It's amaze balls. It's balls of amazing. It's super fantastic, awesome time. Um, <laughs> I'll spring it all on my cereal every morning. This is absolutely gorgeous, and the way you use it is several different ways. There's like several different options. One of them is you put a top coat on, then you put it in on and press it in, um, and you do that twice to kind of create two layers, and it creates a beautiful, awesomely gorgeous effect. Um, another way to do it also is to polish your nails. You polish your nails because you paint a room, you polish your nails. It's that simple. Um, sorry. It's the one thing that was stressing to me in school is um, you don't paint your nails. You paint your house, you polish your nails. 
Anyway, um, so after you polish your nails in a darker color, like I suggest is black or like a deep blue, a deep purple, um, then you uh, brush this on over it and you apply your top coat. Um, absolutely gorgeous effect to it. It is like the bastard child of holograph, hollow and, you know, iridescent. Like they got together and like, bop, bop, and cosmic effect dust was created. Um, I know currently she's sold out. She's waiting for an order to come in. Um, so this is one reason to go subscribe to her so you can go and get this. It's absolutely gorgeous. Um, I may have to do a video on it to kind of show you guys different ways you can use it. Um, again, I have added it to mixes just to add a little bit of extra sparkle. Um, but like Angela suggests, I put it on my nails, uh, top coat, glitter, top coat, glitter, top coat, and it was absolutely gorgeous while it lasted, but because I use my hands constantly, everything chipped off, but that's my fault. So, um, this is absolutely amazing stuff. Um, is it cheap? No. Is it worth it? Yeah. So, but I'll let you go deal with her and the price. I'm not going to tell you what it is, but it's absolutely totally worth it. Anyway, she also sent me some little extras. Um, she sent me some aqua tinsel, neon blue shreds, some jade green metallic fine, hollow purple butterflies, and these tiny glass beads. Um, no holes. Basically what these are is a larger size of a micro bead. Um, if you guys can see that. They are not as small as micro beads, but they are a little bit bigger. Um, so you can use them in mixes. Um, you can use them. Probably the best option for these is, I mean, you can use them in mixes, but these would be great in um, snow globes. It would be great in um, the aquarium nails, um, things like that, just to add a little bit of, you know, um, dimension into your 3D nail work. Um, so, but this, this is amazing. I don't have any of these and I've been looking for them, um, cause I have micro beads. I just don't have them in this larger size, which I love. So again, Angela, thank you so much for everything. I really do love it. You know, I will be coming back to you very soon. <laughs> also guys, I do want to let you know, currently my store is closed. Um, the reason being it is under construction basically where I am, moving things around, packaging things up, and getting things ready to do a relaunch of my store. Um, and I will be relaunching both on Store Envy and on eBay, hopefully, if I can get everything set up in time. <laughs> but um, just so you guys know, don't freak out. I still have my store. It's just I'm reorganizing it and getting it better functioning. Who knows how long it's going to take now that I have hiccups. <sighs> and I'm going to get on. Oh, my God. <laughs> Sorry. Anyway, guys. Um, again, if you are not subscribed to Sparkle Penny Pinch or Angela, please go over. Show her some support. Show her some love. Tell her I sent you. Um, again, take a look at these beautiful glitters she has. She has so many more um, amazing things to offer. She does great mixes. Um Currently, right now, we are, I am in a collaboration with her, um, Sparkle Penny Pincher and Lovely Lunilla, um, on her, aka Tara, other way around, whatever you want to do, um, on their uplifting hope um, for, um, basically, it is a bunch of us from YouTube and Facebook, we are collaborating together to make grab bags, and in these grab bags will be mixes <laughs> um, handmade by some of your favorite YouTubers here in the nail community. Um, myself, Lovely Lunilla, Sparkle Penny Pincher, uh, Cheryl um, from CQU Nail Creations, I believe Jen from Jen's Nail World is in on it, um, Jane from Jane's Addiction, um, so many people <laughs> are involved in it and that is just some of the ladies who have joined in. Um, it is an absolutely wonderful, wonderful cause. Um, basically a friend of Tara's, lovely Lunilla, at her church is currently suffering from cancer. Um, and I believe it, 
is breast cancer, but I, I don't know if it's spread anywhere else or what the details are exactly. But um, anyway, if you are interested in donating, if you are interested in joining in this collaboration to build these grab bags, or if you're interested in buying a grab bag, um, get a hold of one of us. Get a hold of myself here. Get a hold of Sparkle Penny Pincher, Lovely Lunilla, uh, Jane's Addiction, or anybody, and we can give you the information. There is a GoFundMe. So if you are not interested in donating anything now related to this whole grab bag idea, or if <coughs> you would rather uh, donate directly to Tara's friend, there is a GoFundMe, and I will try to post the link down below. Um, so you guys can go over there, show some show support and love and hope um, to help this woman fight. You know, um, it's cancer affects all of us, and um, Rosita just did her group swap based on cancer, and Rosita herself is a survivor, so it affects so many Americans, so many people all over the world. My father has had it. My grandmother has had it. My grandfather has had it. My um, my best friend from high school's mother unfortunately lost her battle with it um, over 10 years ago, and it was not fun to watch the de deterioration of your best friend's mom. The, she's go from the sweetest person in the world to not even be able to get out of bed. It's it's absolutely terrible. This disease affects us at any time, anywhere. It is non-discriminational. It does not care if you're black, red, or blue. It does not care about your sexual orientation. It does not care. And we need to do our best to help and stand up against this. And you know, show people that we support them and that we love them and that they are not fighting alone um, because it can be the most alone feeling thing in the world to feel like you're dying and nobody understands that because they're not going through what you're going through and every cancer patient is different treatments. You could be on the same medicine but be affected in several different ways, you know, it's not the same for everybody. But it is a battle that cannot be fought alone. So please help out. Find out about donating to Tara, uh, lovely Lunella. Find out about, you know, what you can do. Um, go to this GoFundMe and donate and help them pay for their medical bills and everyday life. Um, you know, even do, go to any cancer website and make a donation. But it affects every single one of us. And um, we need to do everything we can to show people who are suffering from it, have survived from it, or have lost their battle, that we are here and we are hoping and we are sending love and hope and um, so many healing feelings towards these people so they know that they are absolutely, unequivocally not alone. So stand up, help us out. Um, again, if you are interested in donating for this uplifting hope and love, Comment down below. Facebook me via, you know, private message. Facebook Tara, Lovely Lunilla. Facebook Angela, Sparkle Penny Pincher. Um, just get a hold of us and we can get you all the information you are interested in. If, again, you don't have the nail stuff to donate, you don't have the glitter to donate, you don't have the mixes to donate, hop on over to the GoFundMe. Donate even $1, even $2 there, you know, whatever you can, um, you know, and help promote it. Maybe make a video of promoting the GoFundMe and let's make this thing grow and help this woman out. Um, you know, and I have talked with a couple of other people saying that if this goes well and we can make this work, um, we can maybe start adding people to our list and we can just make this a huge thing where we, you know, <sighs> glitter for a cure, you know, basically, so, anyway, guys, um, I'm going to leave it up to you on what you decide to do, you have to do the soul searching and figure out whether or not you can find it, um, in your heart to donate to this, um, in any way, shape, or form, uh, do not feel bad if you can't, everyone has financial struggles, um, you know, even just showing your support by saying we stand for her or, you know, uplifting hope and love, you know, just so they know that they're not alone. Anyway, Angela, again, thank you so, so much for this. I loved everything you sent me. Again, if you are not subscribed, go over there, show her some love, show her some support. 
If you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you guys are not subscribed and you want to be, turn that red button to gray. Make it a great day. And until we meet again, this has been Nail Oracle. Bye, guys.